And Jonathan Alpert is a psychotherapist and writes the No More Drama column for Metro Newspaper. Are you seeing more and more women, instead of staying, deciding to leave bad marriages? Jen, I'm seeing a lot of women that feel empowered and they're leaving their uh, their marriages. They're simply not putting up with the BS. We're, we're programmed to do that. It's how we relate to people. It's how we connect with people. So if you're with someone who's complaining about their job or a relationship, listen, be empathetic, but then try to direct them to a more positive place. Manhattan psychotherapist Jonathan Alpert is counseling a number of Madoff's alleged victims who bristle at his continued freedom. My clients are feeling uh, enormous hurt and pain when they see those images. Psychotherapist Jonathan Alpert has heard many woes of Facebook. He joins us this morning. Phil, what's the proper etiquette going through a breakup with Facebook or even while you're in a relationship? Well, for one, uh, when you're in a relationship, you need to be on the same page, meaning uh, where are you? Are you in a are you? committed or are you single or are you just dating so agree to that in real life and then post it up together uh, it could be a romantic experience these people are risk takers they're impulsive I see a lot of cocaine use prostitution with Wall Street crumbling bankers are behaving badly Manhattan therapist Jonathan Alpert says more and more of them are paying for sex some people may drink to cope with stress, others may use drugs. These people are using uh, sex as a way to distract themselves or numb up some of the feelings of anxiety. So instead of managing money, they're managing women. Exactly. Now back to Joy's guest host, Lisa Renna. Oh. If you have to hide something it, that deeply that you would somehow yeah. get sick. And, and that's at the point that I see them. They come to therapy because they're so ridden with anxiety and stress and depression and a lot of times they'll use drugs and alcohol to deal with that. So that's what I try to help them with. And actually we did talk to a psychotherapist yesterday, Jonathan Alpert, about his reaction, if we want to play his sound on this. All right. You need to communicate, you need to share similar values, beliefs, and goals, and that's really, uh, in a very abbreviated way, the secret to a healthy relationship. Joining us now for the discussion, psychotherapist Jonathan Alpert. What's your reaction when you uh, see that? Frankly, the commercial's gloomy, and I don't think it's going to help Tiger. It brings attention to just the thing he's trying to avoid, his personal life. When someone takes his or her life, there's, there's great despair, uh, emptiness, uh, there's absolutely no, no future thinking. To psychotherapist Jonathan Alpert joining us out of New York. Nancy, I agree with you. When a victim testifies, there's a strong sense of empowerment. And to not allow that, we're just uh, perpetuating the victim mentality. The market has been saturated with news about Britney and Lindsay and the like, and people grow tired of this. As the economy worsens, we're connecting with what people truly value. 